am about to show you guys the most unbelievably crazy replay I've ever seen in my entire life. This is the craziest Yu-Gi-Oh duel in the history of Yu-Gi-Oh. Not the history of Master Duel, in the history of Yu-Gi-Oh. And what's crazier than Sky Psychers and Demian Pendulums? What's crazier than this? Uh, you don't even want to know what's in my opponent's hand. So they negate I'm about to put up. What's crazier than that? I don't know what's crazier than that. You not buying a playmat. That's crazier than anything. Because I'm pretty sure you guys should have already bought your Truth Gaming playmats down on www.truthgaming.com. I'm sure you guys have already done that. After seeing how beautiful I laid out all the playmats down in the description below. Which you guys should go, go do right now. And then check out the patient while you're at it. Which I'm sure you guys already did. Anyways, time to showcase you guys right now why this deck and this duel is the craziest duel in the history of Yu-Gi-Oh. So, first things first, I'm going to click fast forward. I'm not going to lie to you guys, my turn is about to be 9 minutes long. I'm going to make my opponent want to quit the game of Master Duel before even being able to play a duel. Zero turn kill. First one in history. But, my opponent actually has balls, just like every Pendulum Duelist, and unlike every Eldritch Duelist, and decides not to scoop. Which is cool, because then you guys get to witness the craziest turn, you craziest duel of all time. I actually couldn't even believe that any duel can happen in the absolute monstrosity way that happens in this duel. I don't even know if that made sense in English. So here we're going to utilize the effects. And if you guys are interested in this Endymion deck, I already showcased a deck profile in this deck. I'm going to showcase the deck profile again later. I don't care. I, I rock with you guys. I love you guys. I want you guys to see the whole deck. But what's going to be crazy about this, you guys got to stay tuned in the video, is what happens at the end of this video and what happens when the Justler. Justler? What kind of name is Justler? The only J-E-R that matters is Joker, which is the best Yu-Gi-Oh card in the game, at least the best normal summon in the game. The best card in the game probably goes to Celine, which we have many Yu-Gi-Oh playmats of on www.trippgaming.com, which you should get right now. Anyways, here we're going to do some more plays. We're just going to literally click buttons. Want to know why? Because when you play the best deck, you don't need to think. You just play. You just look at that. Mighty Master Animation. You just summon. You click and put up a bunch of the gates. That's the strategy, boys. Here we're going to run Mascarena. Maybe we're not even done yet. We're going to use Celine's effect yet, but we're going to summon seven of gates. You don't believe me? You're going to scum in right here. I, the engage in my hand is literally going to sit there. You guys see the middle column, the spell and trap column? I'm going to use engage to keep that column zone warm. I'm not even going to use this engage. I don't want to use the engage. It's too much. I don't need it. I don't care. I'm just going to want to I'm going to keep the spell and trap zone warm with my engage. I'm going to set it like a bluff trap card. Here we're going to want Tapaloza. I'm going to end this turn off by using Mighty Master to special summon itself. Nothing unusual here. This is just the classic Triff Gaming board. This is seven negates. I have no problem with this. This is this is not crazy. This is normal. So far, so far, so normal. So far, it's so normal. Set engage pass. Very normal board. Seven negates. Maybe not normal to some people, uh, but it is to me. So here we're going to pass. All right. Now, this is where it gets really crazy. If you guys stay tuned for this whole video so far, you're about to witness the craziness. What can go wrong? Only have seven negates. What can you? What can possibly go wrong to make me want to quit the game of Macedo? Super Poly. Yeah. You know what? I ain't even mad. I ain't even mad because last time I checked, if I got seven negates, you're gonna Super Poly two of them away. That leaves five left. It's all good. I don't care about a Super Poly. What's a Super Poly going to do? I literally have seven negates on the field. Super Poly is only getting rid of two of them. So I got five left. What's the worst that could happen? I'll tell you. Huh? Are you kidding me? Who the fuck plays this car? This guy just got rid of half of my field with one card. Prada Plant Triff? You're really going to fusion summon myself against myself to try and beat myself? The only thing that could beat Triff is Triff. What can I say? Nonetheless, it's fine. It's not over yet. Everyone knows that where there's a where there's a way, there's a pendulum. So we're not going to give up. He's going to field spell. I cannot let this resolve. And then here comes the crazy shittery. Even more. You think that was it? No, 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 no. Now I've got to deal with Trickstar Candina on steroids, Masquerade Blazing Dragon. Normally, that'll be fine. You know, I have 8,000 life points to deal with this card. But guess what? He has Predipont Triff Gaming over here, and he's going to attack. Uh, he's going to trigger Drama Church, 
Negate the drama church. Get out of my face. Enter battle phase. Look at this. I'm going to be level 4,200 life points. He's going to attack my jackal. I have no cards left. My engage is useless. It's more useless than Farfa right now. I can't do anything. My vortex is in the field. I'm not going to enter battle phase and crash my vortex. I'll have no play. So now I'm going to draw a card. And it has to be literally like Electromite needs to turn into Pendulum form in the main deck. Because there's not many cards to save me right now. I need I have 4,200 life points. So do you guys know how tough it is for Pendulums to play under Masquerade with 4,000 life points? Let me do some math for you guys. 600 times 7 is 4,200. I'm allowed to activate 7 cards. All right. Hopefully this is a crazy card that does not force me to activate a card for nothing. Huh. Fantastic. The worst card in my deck. If I activate this, I lose 600 life points for nothing. All right. It's fine. We got Abductor at 4 scales. I got to come back. There's no... I'm, no man in history has ever summoned Triff on me. And I can't allow... I can't lose to myself in this mirror match of Triff versus Triff. I cannot allow this to happen. No one will super poly me for three and get away with it. I must come back and win this game forever Yu-Gi-Oh! Pendulum Duelist in history. So here I'm going to activate the fact of Magic uh, Abductor. I'm going to trigger Masquerade to burn for 600. I really badly want the special Jackal King, activate a Star Goblin, hope to draw into something nice, and then Mighty Master his ass into Oblivion. But I'm probably going to die if I do that. So I'm going to instead, I'm just going to scale this. I also don't know if he has a hand trap. So I'm going to Pendulum Mighty Master, and I'm going to play like a pussy and just enter battle phase and attack. I don't want to get hit with cards. What if that's a Veiler? I would get cooked. I would lose the game. I would lose to literally burn for 600. So now I activate Upstart. He's going to chain Masquerade, probably thinking Masquerade will still burn. But as every Masquerade player is an idiot, he probably didn't realize that this card says, wow, this card is Fusion Summon, this Fusion Summon card. Uh, I will burn for 600 light points. It is now, no, it is no longer Fusion Summon. It has been Special Summon from the Graveyard. So now I'm going to draw with Upstart. I draw the, uh, the second worst card in my deck, Chicken Game. I do not want to activate that, so I'm just going to pass my turn over here. I pray to God he has no spell. He has no spell. He has no monster. I'm like, thank Electromite. Thank Zark. Thank Jesus Christ. Thank myself. Let's go. Here, I'm going to draw a card. And then, now, it spells defeat for my opponent. Now, I recognize I ain't waiting no more, baby. Now, I'm going to destroy you. Now, I'm going to Mighty Master, blow up your entire board, switch everything to attack position, and pull off what he thought was the craziest comeback of all time. My craziest comeback. Ultimately, you're going to super poly me for three when I have eight negates? That's not enough, baby. Pen best deck. Let's go. Now, I'm going to show you guys the deck profile. Let's go. And this is the deck list. I utilized this deck in the most unbelievable match in the history of Master Duel. And if you think I'm going to let a little pred upon Truth Gaming stop Truth Gaming, nothing will stop Truth Gaming except myself and Anti-Spell. So here, our deck profile utilized Double Magician Souls, Public Magician Blue Boy, Mag Magister of Endymion, Triple Servant of Endymion, Triple Magical Abductor, Triple Abyss Actor Curtain Racer, Mythical Beast Jack of King, Triple Endymion the Mighty Master, One Reflection of Endymion, Triple Upstar Goblin, Terraforming, Triple Lure of Darkness, Triple Into the Void, Public Seeker, Public Knowledge, Double Sky Striker, Mobilize, Engage, Triple Spell Power Mastery, My opponent has No Chance, Triple Chicken Game, Hornet, Drones, and Widow Anchor. That is the deck. If you want to know the extra deck, read it yourself. Got him. I'll tell you guys anyways. Vortex Dragon, Absolute Dragon, Kagari, Hayate, Artemis, Crowley, Electromite, Mascarena, Cross Sheep, Unicorn, Double Sel Triple Selene. You got some nice legs. Apoloza and Axis Go Talker. That is the deck. Absurdly amazing deck. As you guys saw, I had seven negates. I do that every single time. Seven negates every turn. Craziest match of all time. Easy dub for the Pen God. Let's go. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to smash the subscribe button. Make sure to smash the like button. And make sure to get the beautiful playmats in the description below. You got, we got some Celine. We got some Mommy Celine playmats. Looking very sexy. Make sure to check that out. We got some Servant playmats. We got everything. Check it out down in the description. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.